In this video, we'll go over how you can check your stats from your cPanel. When you log into your cPanel, you'll see something like this. And there are different styles of cPanel, so yours may look somewhat different. But usually down the left side here, you can see some basic stats. You can see the disk space usage. And you can see how much you're using for MySQL databases. You can see the bandwidth you've used this much. And this is the amount of data transfer. Now you can get some more stats from here that are more specific. And all you got to do is find where it said, says Web FTP stats. And if you click on that, then you're greeted usually by some other options. You'll have analog, maybe AW stats, maybe Webalizer, depending on your host. You have subdomain stats and your latest visitors, your bandwidth and your error logs. So you can check through all these things. If you only have analog stats, or if you like to use analog stats, you can just click on analog and then click on the month and you'll get some basic stats in here. And a little chart at the bottom. It shows you where people come from, etc. It's got some fairly good stats in there. Now if you don't want to use analog stats, you can use some more graphical looking stats. AW stats. These are pretty stats. And in here you can pick your month and your year if you've been around more than the current month. It gives you your unique visitors per month or for this month and the number of raw visitors. Over here it shows your pages, your hits, and the bandwidth that you've used this month. You get a monthly history down here, shows you your visitors and your bandwidth, just like you see across here. Down a little further, it, it shows you by day and the average, and then in a graphical format, and then when you roll down here, it shows you by day and using numbers, number of visits, pages, hits, and bandwidth for the day. Then you see it by days of the week, hours of the day, then you see where your visitors are come from by country, hosts. Down here, you see what spiders are crawling your site. Search spiders. And here you see how long people are staying on your site. The type of files are accessing. The pages are accessing. The operating systems the browsers they used, what search engines they came from, or if they were a direct address or bookmarks. And then down here, links from external pages, and your keywords down here. Down at the bottom, you'll see how many people actually bookmark your page. That's the approximate number. So that's how you can use AW stats. It's pretty good at telling you what's going on, on your site. You also have something similar, but not quite as graphical, with Webalizer. Again, you have the same type of stats. You First you have a graph, and then down here you can pick your month, and then you break the stats down graphically and by numbers, sort of the same way as we had before, but it just looks a little different. Now the other stats we have down here are your FTP stats. This is just going to show you the FTP accesses to your site. Shows you the number of files, total kbytes, when, they, when the files were uploaded. So it just gives you an idea of the FTP usage, which is the uploading of files to your site. If you have any subdomains, you can look up your subdomain stats here. Your latest visitors, these will show the most recent visitors to your site, and it's displayed a little bit differently here. Okay, so it just gives you some basic information about the pages that people have been visiting and where they came from. Just sort of the basic stats that you've seen before, but just shown as text. Then our bandwidth, this gives you a breakdown of the bandwidth you're using. And here we have our bandwidth for the day, traffic for 2008, 
And then your error logs. If there's been any errors people access on your site, you'll see them here. Okay, so you got nothing there. Okay, so that's all there is to looking up your stats from your C panel.